Today, I'm suspending my campaign for president with the same spirit with which it began. And I could not understand, and I violated this rule knowingly. Now, I appreciate the comments of my colleagues. This is about the closest I'll probably ever have in my life to an I am Spartacus moment. Mr. Vice President, there's a saying in my community, you're dipping into the Kool-Aid and you don't even know the flavor. Uh, you need to... I'm Cory Booker. If you don't vote for me, I'll come to your home, knock on your door, and ask, why not? What tweet? Uh, saying that it is a modern-day lynching that, um, uh, sorry. <laughs> Jesse Smollett. Um, I, I, uh, okay. She put over 1,500 people in jail for marijuana violations and then laughed about it when she was asked if she ever smoked marijuana. I'm so f proud of you guys. The first thing that I'm going to do when I'm president is I'm going to Clorox the Oval Office. And I can talk to those white women in the suburbs that voted for Trump and explain to them what white privilege actually is. Oh, what a tangled web we weave when we practice to deceive, <laughs> Anderson. Do you believe that people that view porn should watch your show? I'm not even sure what that question means. I will be bold without the bull. So I have no, no regrets. We're excited about what we've done. And uh, it's clearly not my time, so I'm going to end my presidential campaign. Socialism is not the answer. I was reelected. I was reelected in a purple state in 2014. It is considered pretty unconventional. You just mentioned you have these two teenagers leading the charge. There are viral memes about you. You guys don't want to talk, and you oppose your person you're representing don't want to talk. I'll debate her in a Wendy's parking lot right now. His failure to gain momentum on lack of media coverage. He wrote in part, thank you for this priceless opportunity as I end our campaign together. Today, I want to use this opportunity with all of you here to announce that I am ending my campaign for president. It's become clear that I'm not going to be carrying the ball. I'm not going to be the president, so I'm withdrawing tonight from the race. I'm announcing today that I'm withdrawing from the presidential campaign. The Democratic pool for 2020 has grown smaller. 